Greetings, Benjamin J from Ben's Trains with another in the series. Well, I wanted to do a video on this tender that I just put together. And I made this out of parts, completely out of parts. And uh, just wanted to do, do a quick video. As you see, it is essentially a Marks tender. It has a tab and slot on the front, or actually on the back. It has a uh, Lionel uh, coupler on the front. Like I said, this is completely made out of parts. The interesting thing, thing about it, of course, is that it is convertible, just like the uh, tilt coupler that I built. You can swing this around, and it's now a Lionel coupler. Really simple to do this. Let me pull this apart. Like I said, I made this entirely out of parts, as you see. So it has a tab and slot underneath a Lionel coupler and like I said you can just swing the couplers around so you have a Marx coupler or you have a Lionel coupler so really simple to do this made entirely out of parts out of the parts box and uh, this body is not for this chassis although when it's on it it actually fits and doesn't look too bad but uh, I'd have to modify it to actually mount it with a screw. But anyway, built completely out of parts. I just wanted to show you how well this works. It's really simple. And uh, right now I've just got a, a couple of screws in here. Uh, this is the first test of it, really. I just got this put together. Anyway, I just wanted to do a quick video. So I'll swing the couplers around. We'll put this on the Marks 10 Litho Consist. I'll leave the body off of it for now. And just put it on the marks consist and we'll take this around running it with a 999 of course we got the camera on the tripod as you can tell So, that's uh, on the marks consist, and we'll take it off of here, we'll swing the couplers around, and put it on the Lionel consist. Here, I'll take the camera off the tripod for this. Okay, so we've got the uh, Lionel coupler swung out on the back, and we'll pull this with a Lionel 2036. Okay, it's on the track, ready to run. Let's take it around. And this is all this stuff in the parts box. But as you see, it works. It works absolutely perfectly. Put some decent screws in this, get everything sorted out, and I have a new tender for either Lionel or Marks. It looks nice, it runs well, and it's universal. It'll pull almost anything now. As you see, just made out of stuff in the parts box. So like I said, I'll uh, get these mounted with some decent screws. I've got a sheet metal screw in here, a plastic screw with a nut there. And uh, I'll probably use hollow wall anchors. We will see. Anyway, I just wanted to do a quick video on this. It's really easy to make it or to modify an existing tender. And so a uh, Lionel truck, and I just added a tab and slot coupler under it. And like I said, you can just swing this thing around and you can use it with Lionel or you can use it with Marks. It's really straightforward and it's really simple. It works really, really well. And the nice thing about it, of course, is that it didn't cost anything. And uh, just parts out of the parts box. And this stuff has been sitting in there for months, years, some of it. And uh, you just uh, swing whatever coupler you want to use to the rear, just like the uh, tender I built for the tab and slot or the uh, tilt 
Anyway, it works. It works really well. It's simple. It only took a few minutes to uh, actually put it together. So like I said, I'll put some decent screws in this. I'll mount the uh, body on the chassis and I will have a universal tender for Marx or Lionel. Really straightforward, really simple to do this, as you see. It only takes a few minutes. And uh, the nice thing about it, of course, is it didn't cost anything, and it works. So, just a quick video. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to drop me an email. Ben's Trains at gmail.com. And as always, thank you for watching.